Uh, CPAC. Do you know what that is? That is the conservative. What is it? Unfortunately, what is PAC? political action committee? <laughs> political action committee. Okay, yeah. it's their big convention every year. It's like have like corporations have a big convention. They have their big convention. I made jokes about it every year. But I can't remember the last <laughs> time we did. It goes way back. I, I I remember once calling it the Woodstock for the mentally impaired. But in years past, it was like the most conservative commentators and senators and governors and. Okay, this year, there's a guy, I've heard this name, I don't know who he is, Jack Prozobic. He's doing sort of like a roundtable discussion, you know, it's a convention, they have these things. This is a quote, welcome to the end of democracy, we are here to overthrow it, completely. We didn't get all the way there on January 6th, but we will endeavor to get rid of it. Am I missing an irony here? Is, is, am, I, am I missing a joke? Or is it as it seems now? They are saying the out the quiet part out loud. Yeah, that they are not. This is SEPA. This is their big. This is Republican conservative. Their big convention, and you have a guy like this, and the crowd is lo loving it. Welcome to the end of democracy. We're here to overthrow it. January sixth was good. Now we're going to finish the job. Thoughts? It's scary. Um, <laughs> thoughts on that? Bill, that was a joke about Trump making a joke about being a dictator day one in office. That is an ironic take on okay. how the liberal that, well, that was my question. Am I missing the irony? Conservatives. I, I think mm, so. Yes, it's I, a joke. Really? But yeah, and I think more, I mean, more to the point. Um, okay. a, a, to, to, to you, Bill, and to, to Keep your day job, Jack. <laughs> Bill Mayer's response to the inability of progressive journalists to grasp conservative humor is an intriguing subject for exploration. Maher's reaction may reflect his concerns about their lack of understanding or deliberate misinterpretation of satire like end of democracy. His response often aligns with conservative criticism of media bias and the perception that conservative views pose a threat to democracy. Understanding this requires nuanced interpretation, considering the role of irony and humor in political discourse and the challenge of bridging communication gaps across ideological divides. Recognizing that Maher's remark was meant in jest is crucial, highlighting the importance of discerning humor, even in political contexts. Maher's apprehension about the crowd's response underscores the anxiety when political humor is misconstrued as a genuine threat and its broader implications for democracy. His concerns about the impact of provocative rhetoric on public sentiment, and democracy's fragility contribute to a deeper exploration of these issues.